many developers search and reuse code from the web. The Bing Code Search add-in for Visual Studio 2013 gives a better code search experience directly inside Visual Studio. After installing the add-in, when you trigger IntelliSense, you will see the How Do I button on top of the auto-completion window. Click the button to open the code search panel. As our first example, we would like to find code to read the file line by line. Note that in the query, the variable file is referenced. After hitting enter, the add-in shows the suggested snippets. This snippet, for example, uses the stream reader class to read the file. As we can see, the variable file appears in the right place. The bottom of the panel displays information about the snippet. We can see the web page where the snippets came from and their titles. You can navigate through snippets from different content providers. For now, we have four partner websites, MSDN, Stack Overflow, .NET Perls, and c -sharp 411. Let me go back to insert this snippet into my code. Now I want to obtain another snippet to generate the MD5 hash code from the contents of the line variable. To do this, I type in the query generate MD5 hash from line. To make the query more clear, we can specify the type of the variable and use the at sign to escape the variable. Now, as before, you can choose the snippet that you like the most. This time I will choose a snippet from Stack Overflow. This is the Bing Code Search add-in. I hope you will enjoy using it. Thank you. Each year, Microsoft Research hosts hundreds of influential speakers from around the world, including leading scientists, renowned experts in technology, book authors, and leading academics, and makes videos of these lectures freely available.